I mean, come on. Y'all see me trying to do this YouTube video? I hate when like they put on the sirens and then don't do anything. I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. guys, Monroe Steele here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel. Do not forget to like and subscribe. So I am starting a new weekly vlog. Today is December the 15th, Sunday. I'm doing a little event with TL Retro Jewelry down at uh, Bloomingdale's on 59th Street. It's really cool, their concept, they take old CDs and they repurpose them into really cool statement jewelry. You guys know I love some statement jewelry. I'm gonna take you guys with me. I'm just gonna be there for about an hour. I'm gonna pick out and show you guys some cool pieces of theirs. So definitely keep them in mind if you're like in the market for some really unique and cool jewelry, especially around this holiday season. I'm really loving my makeup look, rocking my Havana hair ponytail. I did a get ready with me showing you all how I did this ponytail and you guys seem to love that get ready with me so maybe I will do more of those in the future. I don't even know what else I have on right now but loving this look. Let me show you my full look. My viewfinder on my vlog camera is broken. Ugh. Hopefully it's not making a ton of noise like every time it hits the camera it makes a little bump so I'm trying to be so very careful so as not to like get on you guys' nerves. But here is my look for today, wearing these distressed Agoli jeans. They just have that one little distressed part. This turtleneck is from Gallery Lafayette. And then I'm wearing my Celine boots. And I'll put a dupe to these boots down below. I'm also going to wear my favorite hourglass trench coat from and other stories. I think I'm just gonna take a tiny purse. Probably gonna take my Harry on New York purse. You know what, I might take my Cray. Yeah, I'm gonna take my Cray bag instead. I'm not gonna put on earrings because I think I'm gonna get some earrings while I'm there and just wear them with my look. I will check back in with you guys when I'm heading down to Bloomingdale's. Good time at Bloomingdale's with TL Retro. Loving my earrings. They're actually having a 30% off with code HOLIDAY30 on their website until the end of the year. I think this video is gonna go live on Christmas Day, so Merry Christmas, guys, if you celebrate that. I'm starving. I did get a little something from Magnolia Bakery, so I'll show you what I got when I get home, but I haven't eaten all day and I am starving. 
So I think I'm gonna go to this restaurant over by my apartment, eat, and then I'll head home and show you guys what I got from Magnolia Bakery at Bloomingdale's. I stopped by like a local restaurant in my neighborhood, got some food. I actually got ribs. I know. <laughs> Who goes and plays and orders ribs? I do, because I haven't eaten all day and I'm starving. So let me show you what I got from Magnolia Bakery inside of Bloomingdale's banana pudding. I have been craving banana pudding. So I got some. Oh my God, look at it. Oh, can you see it? Can you see? See the deliciousness? Nah, you gotta focus. There you go. Mm. Oh my God, it smells so good. And then I also got, because I'm greedy and I'm on my period. So, you know, I need chocolate. But I got these two chocolate cupcakes with caramel cream frosting. Oh all right, y'all, I haven't eaten all day, so I'm going to eat had a great time at Bloomingdale's. I almost bought some Tom Ford sunglasses, but I didn't. Thank goodness. Anywho, tomorrow is Monday and I'm going to be heading to an event with Danielle and Rose. So I'm gonna take you guys along for that. Then on Tuesday, I'm going to a movie screening premiere of Like a Boss with Tiffany Haddish. So super excited about that. And then I feel like I got a bunch of other events going on next week, so it's gonna be an intense week stay tuned lots more where this came from and like i said i think i'm gonna post this video on christmas day so thank you for spending your holiday with me i hope you all are having a lovely christmas if you celebrate it okay i'm probably at home right now with my family living it up of course vlogging that vlog will probably go live sometime soon maybe next week but yeah today was a fun day stay tuned for more Still not over my earrings. Don't forget, check out that coupon code. I think it's holiday30. Sign up for their email. TL Retro, 30% off of everything. All right, guys, I'm about to eat. Check back soon. Hi, guys. So it's a new day. Today is Monday, December the 16th, and I am up doing my makeup, getting ready to do my Insta stories for the day. But I did get my Artiste brushes in. You guys probably saw them in a previous video. So I'm just gonna show you how I actually use them. The best thing to do is to take your foundation, use your finger and just dot it on your face and then use the brush to actually disperse. Of course, I'm using my two favorites, NARS Sheer Glow and Maceo and Bahia. I've kind of dotted it all over my face just using my finger and now I'm going to show you how the Artiste brush is just simply amazing. Got my brush here. I love the coverage of this brush. And then also you're not using a ton of product. Just what you need. And these bristles are super soft too. Loves it. It feels like a little massage, like it's amazing. So not doing much today, just doing some, my regular Insta stories, promoting a new blog post I did, how I get holiday ready with Walmart Beauty. Walmart has like all the best products. And so I'm showing you guys the best of Walmart in this post, as well as like beauty gifts, holiday gifts, and just stuff that I order a lot from Walmart. They do have really awesome like two day shipping. 
it's so fast anywho this evening i am going to a little holiday event with my girl danielle the style and beauty doc i think rose is coming too it's like an in style holiday gifting suite party so it should be fun i'm going to take you guys along with me and that's pretty much all that's going on today i just threw my ponytail in i'm going to quickly do my makeup for my insta stories today i think i'm going to do orange on my lids and like a nude lip we'll see good afternoon insta stories and happy monday happy start to your week guys it's monday so there is a new vlog post up on my I am done with my Insta stories for the morning. I posted everything I needed to post for today. Took that ponytail out, put on my cuddle duds, and I just got my Blue Apron box in. I usually have it scheduled to be delivered every other Monday. And I'm hungry, it's about 3.30. I'm heading to the party with Danielle. It starts at 6.30, so I'll probably leave out, out of here about 5.30 and take a car. So I have a couple of hours and I'm starving. So I'm going to make these jal jalapeno burgers with goat cheese and smoky roasted carrots. It looks absolutely delicious. As soon as I took it out of the box, I was like, you know what? I'm about to cook this right now. So get ready with me. We're about to cook some Blue Apron.
jalapeno burger. It looks absolutely delicious. Ooh, tastes really good. I love goat cheese. And these, um, like, are they pickled? Jalapenos are the added zing. Anywho, gotta finish eating and then get ready for the party. I'll check back in soon. So I'm all dressed at redressed and ready for the in style party with danielle i'm wearing a very old naked wardrobe dress if you happen to watch my morocco vlogs which i recommend you do it was such a fun time in morocco i wore this dress when we went out to like a cool dinner and i haven't really worn it much since but it's one of my favorite dresses i love a good sheath dress with this texture. I also have a similar one in yellow. And I'm also wearing my TL retro earrings that I got yesterday when I went to Bloomingdale's and hung out with them. They're actually having a 30% off everything sale with code HOLIDAY30. All you have to do is sign up for their email newsletter until the end of the year. So if you're interested in any really cool jewelry made out of uh, repurposed CDs, Check them out. Let me show you my whole look. So this is the sheath dress. It's from Naked and AKD. Wearing my teal retro earrings. My ponytail, I just threw it back in after cooking and eating. By the way, that burger was delicious. And then I'm wearing my Celine boots. I'm going to put on my And Other Stories hourglass trench coat it's my favorite and i'm gonna call a car one thing that i've noticed is that i get a lot of questions asking like you know concern about if i'm cold and here's the thing i don't do stockings i don't do those little tights if it's good enough for anna wintour and michelle obama then it's good enough for me i don't mind being cold i'm an adult i'm okay usually i have on a coat and usually I have door-to-door -door car service, so it's not like I'm outside for an extended amount of time. And it works. I don't really care what season it is. I'm still going to show my skin. Still going to wear skirts. I'm still going to wear dresses. Usually I'll wear longer dresses and usually I'll wear boots. But I don't mind having my skin out in the winter. I'm okay. You should be okay too. And if it like bothers you, then don't watch until summertime <laughs> so let's get ready to go here's the full look with my hourglass blazer or trench coat from and of the stories i got the size eight it fits perfectly and i love my look all right let's go all right guys i am here i'll see you inside it's my friend here running in i'm waiting for rose She's right around the corner. We're gonna go in for the in-style party. Hopefully Danielle is meeting us soon. And I'm kind of talking loud because I don't know if the speaker on my phone is working, but Rose should be here soon. I'm gonna go inside and wait in the warmth. Just leaving the In Style magazine gifting sweet party. I will show you what's in here tomorrow morning. Okay. through Brookfield Mall actually connects to Westfield Mall and we didn't know that we've been walking outside in a cold this whole I didn't time. know it was a Brookfield Mall yeah <laughs> she didn't know Brookfields existed 
And she's, she's, she's the native New Yorker here. <laughs> All right, Monroe's. <laughs> I mean, let me talk to y'all. Let me politic to y'all for a second. I gotta talk to y'all with my New York, my super New York accent over here. Lord right? have mercy. <laughs> when you are born someplace, you take it for granted. That you're like, so oh, you know, whatever, whatever. When you move to a city, you're like, oh, I wanna explore. You know, I wanna see what's there and, and here and there and everywhere. But when you're in, oh, what was the thing that you told me? You were like, hi, you don't know about Central Park ice skating? Let me tell y'all something. Let me tell y'all something again. She's never been ice skating in Central Park. Growing ever. up in New York City in the 80s and 90s, you did not want to go in Central Park. New York I City. It. New York City in the 80s and 90s was quite different. Quite. Quite different. <laughs> This one has been harping on about food. So we're going to Italy. Good morning guys. Today is Tuesday, December 17th. Just made myself a Nespresso coffee. I've been up working since about eight. I sent in a couple of deliverables for some brands. I have a pretty busy schedule for today. I'm heading to Exhale Spa. I'm taking one of their recovery like workout classes. And then I'm also getting my eyebrows shaped and then I'm getting a facial. I think I went there previously, I did. I went there before and I vlogged it where I got a facelift facial and it was so amazing. But they just opened up a new location in the city. This one is closer to, I wanna say like Midtown. So I'm heading there. I'm gonna take you guys with me, of course. I have on my workout gear, got on my Asics workout pants. I love these pants. If I can find them online, I'll link a few for you guys. And then I'm gonna wear my Sorel Kinetic sneakers. It's actually kind of like raining slash sleeting slash snowing right now. So I might just wear my snow boots, boots and take my sneakers with me. Fresh face, no makeup since I'm getting a facial. I just did like my regular skincare routine this morning. I have my little natural curls out. My class starts at 1.30 so I'm gonna head out in a little bit. This evening, I'm very excited because I am going to a movie screening of Like a Boss with Tiffany Haddish, she's in that movie. The movie drops on January 10th. It's a movie all about friendship. And of course it's hilarious because she's in it. And so I can't wait to go to the screening tonight. I'm going with my girl Rose because I, this is the, the kind of movie you go and you see with, with your girlfriends. So when it drops on January 10th, make sure you head to theaters and you check it out. But I'm gonna take you guys a little bit behind the scenes with me to the movie screening because that's what I have going on today. It's a pretty busy day. Gonna run downtown, go to Exhale Spa, get all that stuff done, come back up here, relax for a bit, have some lunch, change, and then head down to uh, the movie screening. So that's what we're doing for today. I had such a good time last night at the In Style gifting suite party with Danielle and Rose. After that, we went to um, Italy, the one that's right down by Century 21. We always go to this Italian restaurant there. It has a beautiful view of like the One World Trade Center Memorial. We had pizza, we had pasta. It was so good, so, so good. And then I came home, but we did get a gift bag. My 
in style gift bag. So let's just get right into it. Let me show you what's in here. This is my first time going to one of their uh, parties. And so shout out to Danielle for letting me be one of your plus ones. Of course, they gave us the December issue of In Style with Renee Zellweger on the cover. I think that's how you say her name. And then of course we have the January issue as well. And look who's on it, Tiffany Haddish. Going to see that movie like a boss tonight. It's out my Hayek very excited about seeing that tonight they gave us this cool little notebook this is good because i need a new notebook for the year it has all like blank pages on it and it comes with a little pen this will come in handy because i like to have a new notebook at the start of every year even though i'm kind of a notebook hoarder and i have a bunch we also have some neo cell true science of collagen super collagen for a healthy hair skin nails and joint support in the french vanilla flavor last night i don't know i think i did record it but we were drinking these like vanilla chai drinks with marshmallows and candy canes in them and this was also in that drink and it tastes pretty good so i'll be interested to use this more and see how it helps we also have a frozen two disney candle from blade it's the icy evergreen forest candle Ooh, that smells like Christmas. I love this. We're gonna like this today. Ooh, a little something from Estee Lauder. Let's see what's in this little Estee Lauder bag. And they did have like little stations last night at the party. They had an Estee Lauder like little makeup station with lipsticks and everything. So that's probably what's in here. Oh wow, so we have the Estee Lauder Beautiful Belle perfume. I'm pretty sure that's perfume yeah it's perfume i want to smell it you guys know how i am about scents such a beautiful bottle it's lovely let's see oh it smells really good it's very kind of light i like it and they also sent over a little pure color envy sculpting lipstick in the color envy 420 Oh, that smells better. Like, you have to let that perfume kind of sit for a bit before you smell it. I want to see the color of this lipstick. It looks really good for the holidays. So this is Envy in 420. Yeah, that's pretty. That's a pretty color. That's a good color. It's almost like a very nudie type red i have no idea what this is it's just a box <laughs> let's take a a look see i think this is a lip balm yeah this is a lip balm here what's in this white box i can't even get it out <laughs> how did they even get this box in here <laughs> it's anatomically impossible there we go so what's in here gabrielle co oh yeah this was one of the things they had there last night as well let's see what's in here oh how cute it's like a little traveling jewelry station it has like some compartments for like your earrings your studs rings little compartments there for things that hang like your necklaces and that's really cute this will come in really handy when i go home for the holidays and when I go to Miami for New Year's, definitely gonna pack that. It's Gabrielle Co. if you're interested. I'll put a link down below. We have some odor blasters from Arm and Hammer. Fruit Burst that you could put in the wash. Chapstick, a few more of those odor busters. Lumify eye drops for when you have a little redness. And last but not least, a little something from Brookstone. Like Christmas came early. Oh, cool. So from Brookstone, they sent over a Big Blue Go compact wireless speaker. That is pretty neat. How cool is that? Very nice. And it's ideal for traveling. It's also waterproof. This will be kind of great for my trip to Miami. I'm not going to take it out of this cover, but that's pretty cool. 
wireless speaker. Thank you so much to the InStyle team for all of these awesome gifts and for inviting me to your awesome party. Well, thank you, Danielle, for inviting me and letting me be your plus one. Now to clean up all of this mess and head down to Exhale Spa. So I'll check back in soon. So I have on my workout gear. I have on my Sorel Kinetic sneakers. Love these. And my teddy coat and this Derek Lamb like shawl. And I'm gonna grab my umbrella because I think it's raining. I'm going to head to Exhale Spa. Lego. the whole train to myself. I love it. Just had the recovery class with the foam roller. It was really cool. Got a little few snacks. Now I'm gonna have my brows done and then I'm gonna get a facial and they give us this cool little rose. Alright guys, getting ready for my power facial here at Exhale Spa and I'm looking forward to it. That was awesome. We did a, a quick little peel, but I'm not going to peel. And um, some light therapy, which was great because I do have a little breakout here. It was lovely. Thank you so much Exhale Spa. Make sure you guys come visit this place. It's amazing. 31 East 32nd Street. Alright guys, thought I would light my candle from my gift bag. I showed you guys the contents of it earlier from the InStyle gifting suite. So I just got home from the Exhale Spa event. They actually just opened. They've only been open for two weeks. They're located on 31st East 32nd Street. I've gone before to their Central Park location, but this one's new. It's really cool. I did a class with foam rolling, which is great. Like as a physical therapist, I think the benefits of foam rolling are just amazing. And then I have my eyebrow shapes. You can't really see them that well, but they look so much better. And I also had a facial in which they did a light peel. I'm not gonna peel or anything afterwards. It's, it was just like a really quick peel to like lighten up any hyperpigmentation and dark marks and take off dead skin. And then they did LED light therapy that helps to kill the bacteria on the surface of your skin and help with any acne flare ups. And that was really nice. They actually wanted me to stay for a massage, but I had to go because y'all know I'm going tonight to the Like a Boss movie screening and I only have about mm, two hours to like rest and get ready to go to that. But they did give everyone who attended a gift bag, this really cool Ola bag. And inside, guess what they gave us? a mini foam roller guys i'm super excited about this it says 
exhale on it from exhale spa i actually don't have a foam roller so this is amazing to have a mini one it's really good for rolling out your tight muscles your quads your hamstrings even your lower back so really excited about this they also gave us each an exhale spa robe super excited about this robe super comfy like you can never have too many robes you really can and what else is in here let me check there's also some is clinical cleansing complex in here this is one of the skincare brands they use during their facials i've actually used this before when i went and had a facial with them previously they also gave us happy place um inspiring tea infused aromatherapy eye gels which are really cool. I'm gonna use these. I've never used these before. I'll throw these on tomorrow and let you guys know how it works. And that's it. Have some water and some juice as well that they gave us. Thank you so much to Exhale Spa. And if you guys are interested in checking out any of their services, I will put a link to them down below in the description box. I am starving, like literally. All I ate was like leftover pasta from the restaurant we went to last night at Italy and I'm starving so I'm gonna eat the burger you guys remember the other day yesterday I made these blue apron burgers well I still have one left because like I said it's three meals for two people so I have a second serving left I'm gonna eat that for dinner and then I'm gonna get ready for the like a boss movie screening so stay tuned guys I'll check back in soon guys and just like that i am ready for the movie premiere like a boss gonna head down catch the train and meet rose there i think i'm gonna stop at one of my favorite places the donut plant and like smuggle in some donuts because i would like some donuts anywho did another orange and pink look this pink is like the pink that i was going for this is actually the rihanna i can't even think of the name of it but it is very pink and i love it get into it you guys i will put a link down to it below so i am wearing this sweater from naked na-kd they have some really great like balloon sleeve sweaters i'm not sure if this one is still in stock because it's pretty old but i will put some links to a few different ones down below in the description box also wearing my favorite vegan faux leather pants from express love these they have pockets they are true to size i'm wearing the size six and then of course i'm wearing my favorite combat boots from all saints these were on sale during the black friday sale so i hope you guys pick them up they are true to size and super comfortable since it's raining outside today i thought i would go with some combat boots and the earrings are from bcbg when i went to the event these came in the gift bag. I'm gonna go ahead and toss on my and other stories hourglass coat and my Derek Lamb huge shawl that I had on earlier. Grab my umbrella and head down to the Like a Boss movie screening. I think the movie comes out January 10th with Tiffany Haddish so you guys, I'll let you know how it goes, how the movie was, and you should check it out when it comes out. Probably gonna switch to my iPhone now, so I'll check in with you guys soon. Oh yeah, I threw my ponytail in too. This is actually a campaign for me, so I have to do some stories, and I also have to do an Instagram post. Make sure you go and check out that photo. Oh, and this is what my brows look like. After that, I had them shaped. She kept a very natural shape, and I actually really love them. They, she pretty much just cleaned them up a little bit and cut my eyelashes down. I mean, my eyebrows, the actual hairs down because they were very long and curly. But I like them. They're a little more defined now. All right, guys. See you soon.
we saw Like a Boss. It was, it was good. Yeah. You definitely Fun. laugh. Yeah. You'll get a, a few good laughs in there. Absolutely. <laughs> Today has been a long day. So I'm glad to be heading home to relax. I don't know what's happening tomorrow and I don't know when I'll be tuning back in, but it'll be sometime this week. For now, I will leave you with is this the Lori side? I'll leave you with the Lori side. Hello guys. So today is Wednesday, December the 18th. I just got finished washing my hair and I'm trying these new Patchology under eye masks called Happy Place. This is actually the first time I'm trying under eye masks, so. Ah! I'm pretty interested to see if they will do anything. Well, I think this one is just ready to be off. This one doesn't want to stay on. Okay, whatever. I'm not doing much today. I had a headache from the moment I woke up this morning. I had planned to film like a YouTube video today, but it's not gonna happen. I just feel awful. I thought maybe it was a caffeine headache, so I had a coffee that didn't help. I thought maybe it was I need to eat headache so I ate and that didn't help so I don't know what's going on but I just took to a leave hopefully my headache goes away soon so I'm not doing anything today I'm going to edit Friday's blog post photos tomorrow my girl Kelly it's me Kelly B is having a little birthday shindig here in New York City if you follow her she moved to California, but she comes to New York pretty regularly, so it'll be good to see her. She's having a little birthday bash at one of her favorite restaurants, and so I'll take you guys a little with me then. She'll probably be vlogging too, and I love her vlogs. A lot of you recommended her when I was asking for black bloggers and YouTubers. Yeah, I already follow her. I already follow Hello Lux, The Notorious KIA. I follow her as well, and Karen, of course. Me and Karen are friends. So all of the ones you guys mentioned, I'm pretty much already following. So I was wondering if there were any more. Today is just gonna be a inside, not doing much. Just wanted to check in for today and also to really thank you guys so much for making this year such an awesome year for my YouTube. Like you guys are amazing. I literally grew my YouTube from like 2,000 followers to over 15k in a little over what seven months i'm really grateful to everyone who watches my videos who leaves me comments who comes over to instagram and follows me there y'all are just so amazing to me and i really appreciate each and every one of you you all i'm just glad that you find me entertaining that you actually like my videos stay tuned because this month is going to be a pretty busy month this video is going live on christmas the next two weeks y'all are going to be insane so stay tuned i also have a really cool giveaway coming up in my next video on sunday december 29th doing a little giveaway make sure you watch that video because you're gonna want to enter this giveaway it's like a little holiday end of the year happy new year type of situation that's it for today y'all i'll check back in tomorrow when I'm heading down to Kelly's party. That should be really fun. And then I'll probably end the vlog there. So yeah. Also, if you have any topics you would like me to discuss on a vlog or in a style video or in a makeup video, drop it down below in the comments because I'm kind of gearing, kind of getting my content calendar together as far as YouTube for next year, at least the first two or three months of the year. And I like to include some things that you guys are interested in. Alrighty, hopefully this headache goes away soon and I'll check back in manana. One of the reasons why I love these bay windows, and excuse me, I was letting my plants have a Sunday, like get it, sun day, is that when it snows, it looks like I'm in a snow globe. So cool. Good morning guys, it is Thursday, December 19th, and I am coming to you early in the morning. It's about nine o'clock. I just got out of the shower. Last night, I washed my hair. I put in just a little bit of product and I let it fully air dry. So this is what it looks like when I just let it air dry. Shrinkage is hella real. I feel like I have 4C hair for sure. And then, well, 
what's going on with the light in here in the back i have looser curls like i don't know if you could see how loose this curl is <laughs> compared to how very tight these curls are that's why when i do my ponytail look that i showed you guys in the previous video with the get ready with me and i did my ponytail anytime i wash my hair i have to put it in a ponytail like to let it air dry or else i cannot get it into a ponytail like if i let my hair air dry like this i i can't like you see how difficult that is to try to get in, into a ponytail that's my, why my little tip of doing it after you wash your hair works better for me because my hair is thick and it is dense <laughs> and i need to do some insta stories today and i'm going to kelly's birthday party tonight so i want to put my ponytail back in i really don't know why i just let my hair air dry i guess i just wanted to show you guys a lot of people are like oh you never wear your hair out um and that's because i'm not about to do it i'm just not so what i'm gonna do is just wet it profusely and then put it back in my little havana hair ponytail all right guys so i'm gonna get that done and then i'm gonna film a video it's gonna go live after this one it's a little giveaway and then i might go do a little bit of shopping i want to go buy those celine sunglasses for my upcoming miami trip all right so i will check back in periodically throughout the day take you guys with me to kelly's party but yeah it snowed last night but it's beautiful today it's absolutely stunning Alright guys, so my hair is done. It took about literally like 10 minutes to get it all together. I'm quickly going to do a makeup look, record my stories for today. I actually have some sponsored stories going up today and I'm really excited about it because I partnered with Amazon for their Delivering Smiles campaign. It's a really good cause. If you shop at Amazon, and I know a lot of you do, you can sign up to like sponsor a charity and anytime you make a purchase, I guess some monies 
will be donated to that charity. You can also choose a charity and donate items directly to that charity. All you have to do is go onto your Amazon account, check out the Amazon Smile charity list choose a charity and then you could donate items directly to that charity i mean it's a great way to give back during the holidays you guys are probably already shopping at amazon anyway the charity that i chose is called win w-i-n and it is women in need it's based here in new york city it's to help women who are having a difficult time find shelter and housing women and their children as well and so I partnered with Amazon and I donated a few items directly to that charity. They have a whole list of products that you can buy and then you buy them and it just ships them right to the charity. Each charity has a list of things that they need. So I spent about, I don't know, $105 and I donated maybe like eight items from their list. And the good thing about it is that all of these charities are verified. So you know that the products you're buying is actually going to those charities. So if you're thinking about giving back this holiday season, and I hope we're all in a giving mood, definitely check out the Amazon Smile charity list on Amazon. You can also choose a charity and I think buying products from a certain list, they get a percentage of money. It's a really good way to give back, so make sure to check it out. Anywho, those are the stories that are going live today. And then I'm gonna go ahead and film this YouTube video and probably relax a little bit before heading to Kelly's party. So I'll check back in soon, guys. If you want a more in-depth tutorial of how I do this ponytail, please go check out my recent Get Ready With Me video, hair, skin care, makeup, and outfit. That'll give you more insight into everything I did and what I use. Oh, and since we're here in the middle of the video, if you're not yet following me on Instagram, and you should be, go ahead and follow at Monroe Steel, M-O-N-R-O-E, S-T-E-E-L-E, -E -E. yes. For some reason, a lot of you spell my name wrong. M-U, no, it's M-O like Marilyn. All right guys, check back in soon. Hi guys, so today was a pretty eventful day. I spent most of the day like recording a YouTube video and trying to get my things together with Instagram. Instagram has just been acting crazy. Like I could barely get enough likes on a post you guys i guess that's why it's good that i've kind of spread my business across like my blog and my youtube and my Etsy shop and not depend on everything for instagram because i've noticed that since i've updated the app that it suppresses all of my posts it barely shows my posts to one percent of my followers if you guys are watching this youtube video and you want to support me please do follow me on instagram and please interact with my instagram posts so that I can keep being an entrepreneur, you know? It's hard out here for a pimp. Anywho, so I am dressed and ready. I'm gonna head to Boucherie. I think that's where Kelly is having her birthday dinner. I just changed into my favorite sweatshirt. I am wearing my Express faux leather pants, which I've just been reaching for more and more. And again, my All Saints boots. I get a lot of questions about these boots. I would suggest you try them on in store if you can because some people are saying they're true to size some people are saying size down i don't want to be the one to tell you the wrong thing so if you can't try them on in store be prepared to return them and get a different size if they don't work for you just because they fit true to size for me doesn't mean it will fit true to size for you so if you can go to the store and try them on do if not just don't buy them <laughs> or be prepared to return them and get your correct size if you want them really bad all right guys gonna walk to the train i think i'm gonna throw on my um, misguided teddy coat with this look and i will head down and take you guys with me to kelly's party i think this might be the last day i'm vlogging for this vlog so yeah we shall see
lovely birthday dinner with Kelly. And now I'm here with Danielle. Hi everyone. And I, I'm heading home because it's cold. It's cold. Y'all say bye to Danielle. She's bye. heading to Ghana. Ghana. She's gonna vlog, so check out her vlog. Are you yes. vlogging? Um, now she has to vlog. <laughs> So I'm gonna get on the train, but thank you so much guys for watching. Do not forget to like yes, and subscribe because yep. I'm still trying to get those numbers up. Get those numbers and up. And have a very Merry Christmas. Bye. And a Happy New Year. <laughs>